Hello and welcome back to our channel, Home Buying in Colorado. My name is Danielle Harvey and I am a realtor with Coldwell Banker Realty. Hi, my name is Nicole Boyette and I help people get mortgages for purchasing real estate. So in a previous video, we discussed the initial process of going out and looking at homes and what things that I suggest you do on your first time out. However, one of the most important things to do is to get a pre-qualification letter. So Nicole, who provides the pre-qualification letter? The pre-qualification letter comes directly from the lender who a buyer anticipates they'll be working with. And what all does a pre-qualification letter entail? It depends on the lender and who someone is working with, but your best chance in this market where a seller wants certainty when they accept an offer is for a pre-qualification letter to basically be the same as cash, meaning that you have gone through the entire vetting process as the borrower with your lender in terms of all of the check boxes that a mortgage lender would require. Um, so things that you know you're going to need to provide are proof of income, which for most people takes the form of a W-2 statement as well as your two most recent pay stubs. If you have assets sitting in a bank account that can show that you are prepared to put your down payment towards the loan, you're going to need to have your credit score run and you're going to need to show the debts that are identified under your name. And what is the importance of a pre-qualification letter? A pre-qualification letter shows the listing agent for the real estate mm -hmm. transaction that you are an eligible buyer. So it shows that you are most likely going to uh, go through the underwriting process for a loan with green lights, that there are going to be no surprises that come up, and that you have been determined um, to be a low risk associated with lending money to. So does a pre-qualification letter mean that you have been approved for a loan? Essentially, it means that you've been approved for a loan. So you have not submitted an application to the lender yet. However, it does mean that you have gone through all the due diligence to prove that you will be accepted for a loan. So at this point in time, by the time you get a pre-qualification letter, you should be having very honest and transparent conversations with your lender um, about do you have the money for the down payment? Is your credit score going to show up as being considerably low or considerably high? Are you anticipating a change in employment in the next few months? Are you going to take on more debt? All of those things are really important so that that pre-qualification letter is a true testament to the fact that you're prepared to buy this house. Awesome. Well, thanks so much, Nicole. Yeah.